So hello guys and welcome back to a new episode, Suji here as usual. So as you guys can see we are starting this new episode right where we left. So I've been mining for quite some time actually now and if you guys could see you know I am, what is it? 12k away from mining level and 21k away from smithing level so as i said as you guys can see i did a decent amount of mining or decent amount of living living rock caverns i guess so first of all let's knock these two levels out to get started with the episode and then we'll see what we want to do in this one okay and this should be the first level i was talking about just a second ago guys so there we go for level 98 mining so let's continue mining just for a little bit longer simply because we are 12 key away from smithing level, so let's get that one as well first. Okay, and this should be the smithing level as well. So yeah, there we go guys, coming in with level 98 smithing as well. So yeah, I guess th these two have one level each to go, 1.2 million XP for both. We'll uh, finish mining a bit sooner than smithing, I guess, and then I will just knock out smithing with the ceremonial swords i actually got a rune ceremonial sword daily challenge today so that will you know boost my xp closer than mining actually but uh yeah other than that we are only 11 levels away now guys so i'm gonna quickly you know finish doing this 38 minutes of mining since i do have that mining juju potion active and we will be back with something else guys Okay, so I just finished my daily Araxor, guys. Didn't get anything really, only got tonics, I think, and a Triskelion Fragment for which I was able to get myself an Elite Clue, but after I recorded the clip, you know, it was without sound for some reason, so I just deleted, I guess. But anyways, let's see what the, we have inside this clue. So, 314k, actually, this is not, not bad clue, actually, not gonna lie, 90k GP. Another 40k from Alk and Mahogany Planks, I will gladly take this one. Hey you guys and see what is this, we're coming in with Dormant Anima Core Helm, second one from this boss already, so yeah, got myself a Reaper, so let's see if we can get anything else. Hey, and another drop, this time it's freaking Blade of Nemora, finally a unique from, oh no, never mind, we did get that Krivus wand or whatever, but... Yeah, that is freaking nice, man. No freaking way, guys. Last skill of the hour. I do get an item after all. So, yeah, got myself another Reaper, obviously, which was Criaro this time. So, I figured, obviously, I would go ahead and do full hour, actually. I also augmented my Armadale Chestplate simply because I want to level it to level 9 so I can break it for 4 Armadale components because I still need to get myself Precise 5 for my Scythe and obviously Precise 5 for the... Noxious web when I am going to get it, obviously. So I actually got, I think, like three wolf beast pieces as well. If I can check, where is it? Oh, okay, it's two. So yeah, I have two armadillo components, and after I do get this one to level nine, I will have six. So that's one precise done. But other than that, this is armadillo helmet number two, and I will have. Yeah, actually, this is a complete upgrade because if you guys remember, we did lose our armadillo helm while we the DC that Rex or so. Yeah, getting our gear back, guys. Okay, so I'm actually about to go and do a raid, but before we go, I can actually siphon some stuff for some invention XP, and this will be invention levels for us once again, guys. So, yeah, that was a royal, really quick, nice, I guess, 1 million invention XP, but other than that, we are coming in with level 101 invention. Nothing new still, this is kind of... Sad, but yeah, I guess six more levels till that luck of the dwarf's ring. And now let's go complete that ring, and I will be back with Beastmaster loot. Okay, so there we go, Beastmaster is about to die. This was a pretty smooth raid, only one training point this time. And for the loot, when this big pig dies, we will be getting ourselves 2.1 million, but reroll obviously. For 1.4 million Grimy Dwarf with Skrunk and Dragon Stones, not too bad of a reward, so we will gladly take it. Okay, so I've been PVMing pretty much the entire day today, actually, which is crazy. Assuming I only get, I only had uh, Armadale Helm and, you know, I did a raid that was worth recording. And yeah, I still haven't done my daily Araxor. And I'm kind of not gonna lie, I don't feel like doing it at all today because I feel exhausted for some reason. Uh, but yeah, I guess we will attempt at least a few kills. I don't know, I feel like I want to do at least a few kills, even though like 
I just don't feel like doing a Raxor at all today, but anyways, let's get the first loot of the day, which is Onyx Bolt. And that is skill number two, Black Dehydes. And that is skill number three, lovely Onyxes, haven't had those in a while. And kill number four, Battle Staffs. And this is skill number five. Cash, so I think I will do one more and I will be done for today. Okay, and there we go, last kill of the day. So if I'm correct, actually, tomorrow is the day that two and three thefts open up. And keep in mind that we have four pheromones in bank. So if everything goes out as planned, I will be knocking out some nice racks or kills during this two and three rotation, guys. But anyways, as I said, this will be the last kill for today. So the last loot is Atris Kelly in Fragment. Horrible loot as the last reward, but oh well, I guess that will do it. Okay, guys, so it's time to prove to you that uh, Arc Daily contracts are really OP because we are about to get ourselves another 99. So drum roll, please. And there we go, this should be the pop-up level 99 crafting coming in. So, yeah, beautiful. I think this one is 22nd 99. Nice, we can now do Hydrix Amulets, even though we do have that one already. But, uh, yeah, not much to say to this level other than, you know, that we are only 10 levels away from Max Cape, uh, which is not bad, I guess. Also, we still have level 98 mining and level 98 smithing, which both are actually 137k and 114k XP away, which is probably going to happen on this episode as well. I'm really happy about this one because I will be... This episode should be really good. If we could get a web before we end this one, it would be amazing because I am pretty sure I will be getting the, these two 99s in this episode as well. Other than that, we still have 95 construction, 97 fishing, which is really close to 98 actually, and level 97 fletching, which is actually all, all, you know, already less than 500k to level 98, simply because of the arc contracts. Like, honestly... I, I feel like I won't even need to do living far live at farm, you know, like, or I will only need to do a few hours of it to knock out Fletchim simply because I've been getting so much XP from the daily R contracts. But anyways, Max Cape is coming closer with every level we get. So now I think I'm going to finish off the two contracts that I still have remaining. Then I'm going to go ahead and do my daily Raxor because I got a Reaper for it. And then we will go ahead and knock ourselves these two 99s, actually. Actually, I can long knock out smithing in like, you know, 20, 10 or 20 minutes because I have this daily challenge that I got today. I already extended it, so I might actually do that one and then just, you know, go to LRC and knock out 99 mining. I guess I will see when I get there, but other than that, I will see you guys from the screen of a Raxor. Okay, so as I said, we have a Rex or Reaper, guys, six kills, so let's do this. First kill is a Water Talismans. And kill number two, Adior. And that is kill number three, Adi. What? Stop doing that, Adior again. Okay, and this is kill number four. Number four for two Sirenic Scales, such a clean drop though, but yeah, a good one though. And there is kill number five, guys, but sadly, I freaking signed myself on this phase, actually, because mirrored back spider spawned, and it was under a, you know, a normal spider, so I didn't freaking see it, and I just, you know, assaulted myself to sign, but... I don't know, man, I kind of want to do at least one more kill, because I have a Reaper, but at the same time, I really don't want to risk, but... Actually, why I am, you know, teasing this, you know, I guess, skill is actually not because of the sign and not because of anything else. But, there we go, guys. We have already killed 400 Araxors. That is pretty nice, I guess, right? Uh, yeah, I am definitely lucky at this boss. Not gonna mention that at all. You guys, you guys all already know that. But, let's see what the 400 loot will be. And it's as bad as it can be. So, uh... Yeah, I guess I will be done for today. I don't want to risk, uh, you know, killing myself. So let's go ahead and get ourselves level 99 mining and smithing, guys. Okay, so this is working out just fine, I guess. I don't know why I was even worried. But yeah, there we go for another one. Uh, 99 mining this time, obviously. Anything new you will collect. Oh yeah, doesn't matter. I do have that already. But uh, yeah, 
obviously smithing wise 23k away from that one so that's like 20 minutes i think of this place so without me you know blabbering too much i will just quickly you know continue mining until i get this one and i will be back with smithing i get i, I as well guys Okay, so we were kind of late, like by a second for mining, I guess. So let's not do the same mistake for smithing because we are 58 XP away. So that's, oh my God, no way to XP away. But uh, yeah, anyways, do we get, uh, we do get this another one. So yeah, there we go for 99 smithing as well. So yeah, this is number 23 or is it 24? I am kind of confused. So, well, anyways, we have construction, fletching and fishing left. So that is free skills. Yeah, this is number 24. Okay, so yeah, loads of new stuff, obviously. But yeah, other than that, for 99 this episode, I am kind of loving it i'm not gonna lie uh does this mean we are actually getting max cape next episode hmm, i'm not sure but yeah anyways other than that uh not much to say at this point i guess uh i'm gonna continue mining for now i think because well actually my perfect plus potion is about to end in like eight minutes so i might actually move on after it ends but yeah as i said fletching will be done by doing livid farming and afking fletching simply because i do need to work on that completion escape you know and i might as well do it just now fishing i am really close to 98 will get 98 actually by doing divine locations in two days so i don't think i will rush this one so i will either work on 99 fletching next or i actually might you know just go ahead and knock out 99 construction early i guess because i still do need to get those materials to unlock myself that monkey butler or whatever so uh yeah other than that really happy to get these 99s guys obviously we'll turn off the daily challenges and now you know let's move on i guess softly and yeah Okay, you guys, so if you stayed this far, I guess, into the episode, you kind of came to an end. Uh, so, yeah, we will conclude this episode actually with an oyster because today is the 3rd of May. Yeah, uh, and yeah, I, uh, I haven't actually, uh, you know, done my monthlies yet, so I should have, you know, done them two, two days ago. But I guess this will do it because I wanted to end my epi this current episode on it. But first of all, let's open the oyster to get... Complete, gar complete garbage as usual, 156k. Wow, this this is actually this actually looks so bad. It's disgusting. But yeah, also, uh, yeah, there's actually nothing much to say. I think I wanted just to say that I was really happy with the end. Uh, you know, with the outcome of this episode because we did in the end we did get ourselves free 99s this episode, which is extremely nice and actually. I am really close to a fishing level and I think I will be getting it from this. I don't actually know for sure. But yeah, uh, whatever the end may be, you know, in the next episode for sure, we will be maxing our total, I think, guys. So yeah, we will be getting that max cape in the next episode, I think. So yeah, I was correct in the end. There we go for level 98 fishing. So yeah, this looks even nicer now because we only have one fishing level, two fletching levels and four construction levels to go. I do obviously have all the T-clocks required for 99 construction for me, so that won't take me long at all. I just need to get myself that monkey butler. I don't have the materials, you know, for it just yet. So I have to dis I will have to disassemble some stuff, but that won't take me any time. But anyways, other than that, really happy, as I said, with this episode. Hope you guys like it. Uh, and yeah, I guess, hope you guys are ready because... Yeah, I think next episode will be our, you know, Max Cape episode. I am honestly beyond excited. Uh, I hope you guys are too. And other than that, thank you guys very much for watching this episode. And I will see you in the next one. So take care.